few years prior, I had just moved into this beach house and he doesn't just go up and make friends. He, I took him to the dog park and I watched him just not want to play with dogs. He's so much more comfortable in the water. This is his real natural habitat. He just has a different bond with water animals. It's really cool when he's fascinated by another life. I was lying down and I look up. Uh-oh. And then after that, I'm not even kidding, the sea lion showed up three to four times a week at least for two years. He would pop out of the water and just stare at him. Is that your friend? Who is that, Sam? It was so unbelievable. They had this really gentle, curious manner about them. They just wanted to be in each other's company, and that was enough. We love to think that the sea lion came to rest in front of our house so that it could spend its final moments with Slim. He wasn't constantly wondering where his friend was, but every time that he would come around, it was like the greatest surprise ever. You can just learn so much from animals. I think the biggest thing is that they live in the moment.